For everyone who's been watching the channel for the past couple weeks, you know a lot of very, very strange things have been happening to me on Roblox. That sounds so stupid when you think about it, but... Like, like okay, you have been identified as Flamingo. I am on an alt account. Yes, it's correct. Okay, I am on this alt account. Uh, let me do a recap real quick. I'm sure most of you know exactly what I'm about to talk about. All right, so let me mute this real quick. I just, w I just want to catch you guys up to speed real quick. So there was this guy, Rust. There was a top comment on one of my videos. I okay, right here. There one the top comment on uh one of my scary videos cuz I have been making a lot of videos on these creepy uh creepy Roblox games. I've been doing that a lot for like the past month. So a top comment told me to go to Rust 010's profile and play his game. And I'm starting to think that the person who wrote that comment was Rust 010. It, it, there's a lot more weird details. So basically, when I get into the game, I I've tried it on, like, multiple accounts. It says that thing, identified as Flamingo. When I'm not even, like, this game was made for me and targeted for me. This is what makes it so weird. All right, I'm sure most of you know exactly what happens. Uh, there's a phone ringing. You gotta go to it. And okay, look at that guy. Ah! Wait, a jump scare's about to happen, guys, so... Yep. And who is that? That's me! It's, it's like, dead version of me. And then when you oh, answer the phone... Hey, little mama, let me whisper in your ear while I don't know. So basically, We're sorry. then that happens. Uh, pretty much all of you know this already. I just want to catch anyone up real quick who hasn't hasn't kept up with this series. So before we start, uh, there there is a few more details I'd like to share with everyone. This Rust guy. So he, I'm his only friend, which is that I don't, that's pretty sad for him. <laughs> Loser. <laughs> but I found something very weird. If I click on my like, uh, my Roblox homepage, you know how you can see like when everyone someone updates their uh like you can see the group shouts or Felipe Arugo was swearing in Spanish or something. I was real walking real fast like room room, but then I trip and fell. Oh. No. <laughs> See, there's a lot of things like that. If I scroll... Okay, it's not... Okay, wait, wait, wait. I, I have a screenshot of it. Okay, it's really weird. It used to show older uh, status updates for my friends, like, before I even friended them. But uh, I have a, I took a screenshot of it because it has strangely been deleted from my feed. Here it was. Rust in November 11th, 2017 said, acquiring subject. It's like almost February now, and like he just recently got my attention. He's been trying this for months now. Oh, oh geez. Oh, I, I, I opened up the game and that really scared me. Okay, wait. So over here somewhere, there's a computer, and you go to this thing. That This is something he added. Smile. You click that, and it takes you to this really creepy forest thing. Apparently, there's been some updates here. Okay, see? Okay, so this game makes, like, all these fake people. Lamborghini kid. Okay, one. This guy's fake. He, do he doesn't even have a Lamborghini. Or Lamb... Borg High. Spelt it wrong. This is not a real person. He does not show up on the player list. This is what makes it so weird. <gasps> see? But they, like, walk around and stuff. And I swear, you'll, you'll see it later in this... Ah! Okay, so that thing... That thing is in the forest, too. So let me just... <laughs> yeah, it does that. Okay, this person, this is a real person right here. So I got some info, uh, for, okay, so what, Albert, oh gosh. Whoa, see, see, look at them. See, they do that every once in a while, and then they just run off. I'm, try I'm trying to catch you guys up as fast as possible, but, um, okay, so the last time I was here, uh, a couple people joined my game. So let me try to find it. Okay, so wait, this guy. So wait, okay, no, wait. So Jimmy Biscuit 74, right there. That's somebody who uh was like exploring this whole forest for, with me for like half an hour. And there was this other guy, uh, Reflection Killer. So Reflection Killer is perfectly normal, but there's something very strange about. J it sounds so stupid, but there's something very strange about Jimmy Biscuit 74. Okay, so you see Jimmy Biscuit 74 there. So I made this video. I recorded this on January 24th, and I uploaded that January 25th here. You can see Jimmy. Okay, wait, Jimmy Biscuit 74. He just seems like a perfectly normal guy, right? Well, his account was made on that same exact day that. That I, uh, that I went into that forest. The smile place. And I have something way more weird than that. So, that kind of raised my suspicions about Jimmy Biscuit. But then, okay, so let's open my chat logs. 6.13 p.m. 
Jimmy Biscuit says, hi. What el who else messages me at exactly 6.13? The Rust guy, 6.13 p.m. with just a smiley face. So basically, this guy, Jimmy Biscuit, was all a lie, and it was this, it was Rust the whole time. The guy who made this game, he was following me around. Like, he, he was my friend. He was my little comfort buddy. So I was like, see, Jimmy Biscuit 74, rare sighting of him. I basically was running around this forest with the person who made the forest. Oh, oh, geez. That, you know, this is probably the most disturbing part of the whole thing. See, I don't even know if these are like real people. Like, well, I know they're real people, but I don't know if it's set up by Rust. So uh, the other people I was with. Okay, so there we- he created a smile chat, this reflection killer guy. This is the perfectly normal guy. Jimmy Biscuit is- is Rust. A hundred percent. Message me- okay, we found something, like a shrine. It's a square shape. What you have to do is make the NPC go into the cave with the red square and do that until the shrine is full. I can't help, I have a midterm tomorrow. He never returned from his midterm. <laughs> I haven't heard from this guy since then. And what he means by the NPCs, he means those fake players. We have to, like, push them into this shrine, I guess? I don't, see, like, the thing is, I don't even know if that guy, Reflection Killer, is Rust or Jimmy Biscuit. There's, like, so many layers to this story, and it makes me really, like, uncomfortable. Because now I'm becoming paranoid. I don't know. I can't trust these people. Are these actually, like, just fans who followed me here? Or was it Rust just, like, waiting around here for me? Like, I don't know. <laughs> because that's what he did with Jimmy Biscuit. Even more weird, I gave Jimmy Biscuit all my credit card information. Now, and all my money has mysteriously disappeared. <laughs> okay, I didn't do that, but I trusted Jimmy Biscuit with my life. Okay, so, um, I'm just gonna take these people. I, I, I'm, they're, they're on the, my new battle buddies. We need to find the shrine, okay? Come on, guys. Oh, okay, wait, I just saw it! Over here, what is that? Is this the thing? Okay, so what do we do now? Do we take- <gasps> The music stopped, okay. Do we take the fake players into here? <laughs> Button, <laughs> button! <laughs> My minion child, I have raised you so wrong. If only, you know what, I, I can't even, I was about to say, if only Jimmy Biscuit was here to help me, but Jimmy Biscuit was fake the whole time. See guys, you never really know who's your fake friends and who's your real friends around here. So I don't know how I can try to remember how to get back there, but if I have to take the characters in there, that's going to take so long. What is this? <gasps> uh, what? Ah! That's, okay, that's a fake person. Yoo-hoo. I'm taking them in there. I'm taking them in there. Now. They run away! I didn't see that last time. This is where the fake people spawn. Okay, there's another one over here. So I'm pretty sure the, the shrine- No! How do you even get them over there? I need to know these things! Okay, I'm in a server all by my lonesome. Um, you know, you know, you know where I am actually? I'm in Jimmy Biscuit's Creepy Stuff Hunters, uh, private server. If only Jimmy Biscuit was here to help me out with this. Come on, what do you do? I don't know what to do. Do I do I wait for one of them to spawn here and then take them back uh over there, I'm guessing? It's that's so hard to do when they keep running away like that. Okay, I found one of them. Yeah, oh jeez. Oh, Jimmy the gamer. Okay, so the, the shrine thing is like the opposite side of the moon. So it's somewhere this way. He's like running through it. Hey, good boy, please. No! Jimmy! <laughs> <laughs> he died! And he has spawned as, uh, Dark's Hots. Okay, let me- Okay, please, just let me push you. Ah, oh, this is gonna be so hard to push you because you're so little. You have to, like, push her in such an awkward way, too. Like, I gotta, like, put my screen to the side and then- Oh, okay. Where's the red thing? Okay, she's doing the thing again. Please just- Why?! Okay, so I spent all that time rounding her up. I, I don't I don't know where she is anymore. I, I looked away to try to find the red thing because I have this this is such an impossible puzzle. And now she's just gone. She just disappeared. That's something she decided to do today. Are you okay? Oh jeez, this girl doesn't know. Oh jeez! <laughs> He's not okay! Uh, Albert! Oh wait, are you a real player? Okay, do you guys know what- Okay, I asked them if they know any secrets here. Okay, there he goes. No, yes. What, what do you know? What could you possibly know that I don't? They can respond? Hey, okay, let's just get the- Hey, scram, scram, we're having a meeting here. Ah! Wait, hi. Hi, dad. Whoa! We've defeated him. He's a tall man. That is your secret. 
It is now finally confirmed that he is a tall, f tall man. We have gotten the measurements and everything. Okay, so me and my homegirls. <gasps> no! Okay, so the the red thing is over is behind me in this. Stupid! Oh my gosh! If we get this far and screw up, I am going to start crying and pooping. I will have diarrhea in my pants live on television. Yes! Look, he's going to the thing! What does it do? Ah! What did it do? But what? What do we get from this? I've been playing this game and I have not found much high. That seems to be the story with everybody. There's like nothing here. There is no secret message or anything. Well, guys, I really wish I had more to offer you with this video, but this is it. This is all we've gathered so far. Like, I'm so angry because I've been, I've been here for like almost about two hours now. And what do we have? We have a dead guy right there. And then this. And when I put this guy over... Hey! Then when I put this guy over there, like, it didn't even do anything. At least the other guy, like, pressed a button or something. Okay, so, uh, I know this wasn't really, like, I didn't find out too much, but I did find out who Jimmy Biscuit really is. Uh, that's gotta be worth something. And I found out the game basically either, okay, so it either doesn't work, or you have to take, like, 20 of those guys to the, to the little shrine thing. And boy, let me tell you, I do not have the time to do that. I'm gonna try to find out more. I'm gonna contact Rust himself or I might as well just say hey, hey Jimmy Biscuit because Jimmy Biscuit is literally the Rust guy. That's all I have for you today. <laughs> Thank you.